we have seen that the choice they had in the BJP government, which the people voted to power, has been dismantled one by one. First and foremost, in the economic problem that we are facing now, the most important problem is price rise. At that time, they used to talk about the rise of petrol, the price rise issues, when they were in the opposition, they used to take to the streets. But what do we see now? Now for the common people, petrol has reached more than 100. Price rise is skyrocketing for everybody, for you and me, for everybody. It's becoming very difficult to even make ends meet in the household. Every housewife, every man who works in an office, every daily wage earner feels the pinch of the skyrocketing prices. And what about the two crore jobs every year that they had promised? We don't see anything now. Unemployment has been the highest in the last 45 years. And even now, in every state, unemployment is a big, big issue. And our youths are very, very disheartened with what has been promised to them. So these two economic issues, we want to take to the people of the country through the Bharat Jodo Yatra. Secondly, we have seen that in the last eight years, unprecedented social tension in India. Everywhere that, that you go, you find that there is some kind of communal hatred between people, which is something like an engineered way. We have grown up in an atmosphere of harmony and secularism. You, me, everybody, in our schools, we were taught that unity and diversity. Because India is a country with so many different religions, so many different communities, so many different languages. But now, we see that it takes just a small instance of incident to create a spark. Sometimes we feel that this kind of work has been engineered to divert attention from the real issues of price rise, of unemployment, of what they have not been able to deliver to the people as promised in the elections. So in order that people don't question the government, so that people remain engaged in these social tensions, we feel that these are encouraged, that there is a conspiracy to keep people engaged in hatred, in creating animosity between each other. 